Hey everybody, for a long time I've heard a rumor that at the very top of the central branch of the Vancouver Public Library that there's a garden open to the public. It's Art Phillips Garden, Memorial Garden, and two other people too. And finally today, I have made it to the top. I have found that garden. So why don't you take a quick wander around it with me before I head down the stairs, okay? Just a quick wander of this rooftop garden at Vancouver Public Library Central Branch on Georgia Street. Here it is, the rooftop garden. Now just take a look at this. Apparently, it does get quite colorful in the spring as things come into bloom. BC Place there in the foreground of the garden. Here we are, it's the Art Phillips, Bob Hager and Rudy North Garden. The garden honors Art Phillips, Bob Hager and Rudy North, visionaries, city builders, businessmen and philanthropists who contribute to Vancouver through their numerous charitable pursuits. August 2018, it was officially opened. Some nice seating areas. That's, of course, the inside of the public library's ninth floor. It's a total reading area. This is the rooftop garden. BC Place there. Remember when it used to have a inflated dome that looked like a marshmallow. I'm just walking along the garden, rooftop garden of Vancouver Public Library Central Branch on Georgia Street. It is a beautiful evening, I tell you. I'm quite enjoying myself. I'm in a bit of a mood too, a smiley mood. I don't know if any of you are out there or not. I don't know if anybody's even watching, but you know something? Does it really matter? I'm having fun. It's gonna look beautiful when they're all in bloom. Now this here, what's it say? Evelyn Law, Vancouver Poet Laureate from 20, 2011 to 2014. George McWinter, Winter, Vancouver Poet Laureate, 2007 to 2009. There's a few names over on this one as well. See if I can get in a little closer. We got Christy Lee Charles, Poet Laureate, 2018 to 2020. Brad Cran, 2009 to 2011. Rachel Rose, 2014 to 2017. The Poet Laureates of Vancouver are honored with these little displays on in the rooftop garden at the Vancouver Public Library Central Branch. Now we are going to proceed to walk down and hope that my vertigo doesn't catch me at all. If it does, at least you guys know where I am. Now, I'll be honest, I'm not even sure that I can go all the way down on the outside of the building. At some point, I probably do have to go in. This is the ninth floor. Another beautiful, another nice seating area for reading and relaxing, R observing. I like the fact that it's pretty, it's not totally wheelchair and scooter and needed devices, but they are working on it and improving things. Now, I guess I have to go back inside at this point. Hmm. Keeping up with me? Are you? I don't know. There's got to be a way in, right? Ah. No re-entry through that door. It's got to be a way to get back in. Maybe I have to go back up to the top floor. Won't that be a... Oh, right here. I found the stairs. Ha. That's the eighth floor, by the way. Another reading area. No. Oh, maybe I can't go through. 
Hmm. How do I get in? Maybe through this door. Nope. Guess what, folks? I gotta go back up to the ninth floor. That's a bit of a bummer. Oh well. Now we go back up. Good exercise for my legs. <laughs> yep, I'm walking back up to the ninth floor of the Vancouver Public Library. Anybody even out there watching me? I ran across because, well, that scared me a little. So, I'm going to go inside. I don't know if anybody's watching this here, though, is the rooftop garden at the Vancouver Public Library, Central Branch on Georgia Street.